So off their top of screen in the distance is Queenstown and then it uh, comes down here to Frankton. So the area you can see is Frankton and then you've got the Queenstown Events Centre and uh, this lovely venue. We just zoom in here. These shots coming to you from halfway up the Remarkables, which is one of the ski fields in the Queenstown area. Hodel would get another opportunity and his first day was a real tale of ball dominating bat for four deliveries and the bat dominating ball for the last two. Yeah. Slow bouncer and well controlled by McCullum. So he's not just swinging, that's a good sign because if he was just swinging he probably would have gone hard at that but he realised it was a slow bouncer, checked his shot and controlled it beautifully. of the true nature of this pitch. Even though there's a pace in it, you can trust that bounce and maybe the line just a touch too straight based on the field set. The two fielders out, a third man and deep cover. Well, there's an illustration of why Jesse Ryder is such a hard man to control because if you give him width, he'll smash you through the offside like he tried to there. If you get too close to him, He's got the ability to hoik it away on the onside. He can play pull shots, and he's a good driver, so... He's a hard man to contain because the margin for error is very small. He appears to have very few weaknesses, just stands there, watches a the ball, and it plays accordingly. Moment, perhaps, just trying to over-muscle those ones that are outside off stump. Trying to hit them a little hard. Yeah, you can see just rever rehearsing that shot to lean on it. And he's not happy. Slips come out as well. And I think given that the impetus might be a decent idea, two men in that short cover position. A bit nervous as one of those in there because he is going to hit it hard through that area. Straight. No one's going to be placed there. And no one's going to be far enough back. It's almost a situation now based on this start, based on the first four overs that Paul played a slow one from Jason Holder. But you almost have to go death bowling, get good Yorkers in, because both batsmen are hitting through the line of the ball quite nicely, trusting the pitch. And it is a good pitch. And you pick that very well. Big danger signs for the West Indies if they can't break this partnership. It's worth 43 from just 13 deliveries. Good stop. 13 from that over, 48 for one. 